how to check if a design you want to do is trademarked. Nice and simple. Welcome to the first episode of 4 Minute Friday. That was a cool little intro, wasn't it? Well, on Fridays, I've decided to do a new segment called 4 Minute Fridays, where it's going to be very simple tutorials, just showing you something quick and easy. You know, it could be a Photoshop tutorial, it could be a Canva tutorial, or it could be what today's episode is about, which is finding out if a design you want to do is trademarked. Nice and easy. So, first thing we need to do is let's put four minutes on the clock. And then, what we need to do is we need to head over to our computer and go to Redbubble and pick a design that we can then go and check. Okay, we are on Redbubble. Let's just pick a quick design. We've only got four minutes here. So we've got all of these, all of these, all of these. We're gonna just go with, hang on, let me overthink this. Okay, because that's becoming a big, big trend. So, all we need to do is, we've got, hang on, let me overthink this. We need to go into Google and we need to search for USPTO. Trademark search, nice and easy. Okay, then we wanna go over to the second link, uspto.gov, search trademark database. Again, very simple. Everyone should be doing this before launching a design because you have no idea if a design is trademarked until you do something like this. So once you're on this page, you wanna click search our trademark database. Then you want to click basic word mark search. Okay, and now you want to put the, the phrase in. So the phrase is, hang on, full stop. Let me over, th over, think, think this. Submit query. Yes, when that shows up, it basically means that you don't have to worry. There are no trademarks. Now I wanna show you what will show up if you can't do a design. So let's go back. This idea was super, super popular back in the day and I used to do a lot of it before it became trademark, but I'm gonna show you what it is. So it's very, the phrase is, what's your super power? Okay, and then you can see, bam, okay. You've got live or dead, you've got live, live, live. So I'm a witch, what's your superpower? I'm a teacher, what's your superpower? I'm a survivor, what's your superpower? You see, and I used to do this a lot with jobs, like I'm a photographer, what's your superpower? I'm a bartender, what's your superpower? It was a hugely popular niche and Clearly, you can't really do it anymore. Now, obviously, they, they might not all be taken, but these are the ones that are taken, and just the watch your superpower is dead. I teach what your superpower is dead, so you could do something like that. So if we click this, it will say abandoned, right? Blah, 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 blah. blah. Okay, so let's go back to one that's live. I'm a witch, watch your superpower. So we can see here, it will say first use, all of these things. It will say it's live over here. It will say it will give you quite a lot of information and it's quite interesting. So, and that's a design, right? So I don't know if it means that design is specifically trademarked, but you can see this person has seemed to have trademarked all of their designs. It's all the same, it's all the same design and it looks like it's for t-shirts. So that is how you would check if a design is trademarked. So make sure to do these checks before posting your designs. Now, of course, that is just checking the phrase. That doesn't mean if a phrase says you can do it, it doesn't mean you can just go and do whatever graphics you want, you can do whatever imagery you want. You still have to make sure everything within your design is allowed. So just because the phrase, hang on, let me overthink it is okay, it doesn't mean you can say, hang on, let me overthink it, and you can have you know, a Star Wars image in there, or you have a font that you're not allowed to use, or you have some graphics that you're not allowed to use. Everything has to be okay, but we're starting with the basic, which is the phrase. That is our first four minute Friday episode. Now, I have no idea how long it's been and you can probably tell, you know, was this four minutes? Was this not four minutes? I feel like this is gonna be a running theme for these episodes. They're gonna either go under four minutes or over four minutes, but whatever, it is what it is. Let me know what you think about in the, let me know what you think in the comments about this new four minute Friday segment. And I just wanna say thank you so, so much for watching. I really, really appreciate it.